So I think my, my question is actually to my question is to Clifford Stone. You, you said that you had seen aliens on a on a craft that had crashed. I wondered if you could describe what they looked like. I could. I could, but it would probably take a whole lot of time. The reason I state that, when I got out in 1989, we had cataloged 57 different species. Investigation was launched into this whole subject, and uh, a document was prepared which uh, concluded that at least four species had been visiting Earth for thousands of years. Steven Spielberg approached the Air Force for their cooperation on close encounters of the third kind, and he was turned down on exactly the same grounds as, uh, as were the producers of those uh, earlier films. Uh, this is a letter from uh, uh, Major Sidney Shaw of the National Guard Bureau to um, Columbia Pictures, who produced the film. He said, We have reviewed the script and believe it would be inappropriate for the Air Force National Guard Bureau to support the production. In 1969, the USAF completed a study which concluded that there is no evidence concerning the existence of UFOs. We have not been involved in UFOs since that study, other than answering queries about that study. The proposed film leaves the distinct impression that UFOs, in fact, do exist. It also involves the government and military in a big cover-up of the existence of UFOs. These two points are counter to Air Force and Department of Defense policy and make support of the production inappropriate. <laughs> 